Hey guys, Sophie the Couponer here and welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we are hitting Rite Aid. Yes, I'm so, so, so excited to hit Rite Aid this week. There were so, so, so many clearance finds um, really on Revlon makeup. So it was pretty, pretty awesome. And we had, I bought a rebates. So I got paid to take out makeup from the store. I don't even wear makeup. <laughs> but um, it was really, really nice. I paid like $25 after tax. Got $39 back from Ibotta. So I made money. Oh my God, the sun is literally in the way. But um, yeah, I am really, really excited about Rite Aid deals. So I'm going to get right into the video, the deals, and then the receipt. And I'll probably have a printable breakdown down below. All right, so I am at the makeup aisle and there is so much Revlon makeup on clearance. Like, look at this. And we have a $3 rebate. So I'm going to find the best, best deals and make money out of Revlon. The next deal is on Listerine. So when you spend $12, you're getting back $6 in bonus cash. Now, this is a limit of two. So I'm also going to combine this with the Listerine rebate. I will have that link down below for when you spend 30, get 10. And an activate rebate when you spend a 10. Or when you spend 30, you get back 10. So uh, definitely, definitely, that is going to be awesome. And we have $1 coupons that we just got. Um, so I'm going to be using those. And then I found us some dial on clearance that I definitely wanted to include in my scenarios. So because I did that, it actually ended up um, being able for me to use that 5 off of 25 coupon, and then I wanted to pick up these Skittles, these are just 2 for 7, not really any bonus cash deal, but I do have, like, a bonus cash challenge, when I spend a certain amount, I'll get, like, a dollar eighty back, so I went ahead and got those, then I found this one Revlon thing on clearance for three seventy four, and it says save $2 now, so I'm thinking I'm gonna pay one seventy four, getting $3 back from my bottom, so it makes it a money maker, so I'm gonna pick that up as well. Oh boy, so as for Revlon clearance, look at all this. I should be paying like $23 before tax, getting like 30 something back into my bottom, making these all completely free and a huge money maker for me. So I'm also going to be using a 5 off of 25. So that's how it's going to be a money maker. The next deal and the last one is on the General Mills cereal. These are two for six this week. And when you spend 12, you're getting $3 back in bonus cash. So I'm going to pick up two Cheerios, two Cinnamon Toast Crunch, totaling me $12. We have a dollar off of two paper coupon. I'm going to pay 11, getting $2 back from my bottom, 50 cents per box. I should be getting $5 back from Fetch for finishing a bonus. The $3 in bonus cash and then a dollar from coupon coupons.com for the two boxes that I did not use a coupon on making four of these boxes completely free let's get on to the receipt all right you guys we are back home look at everything we picked up today at Rite Aid I am loving Rite Aid like I said I'm probably gonna do it like once a month it really depends the deals but I'm definitely definitely gonna do it once a month because we got bonus cash the good thing is it takes a month to expire so when there's some deals I'll go ahead and pick it up now again thanks to Jody for the Listerine deal and the cereal deal um, everything else is literally clearance. Um, the Skittles is something that I wanted to pick up because I had a bonus cash challenge. Um, I didn't get, like, any good bonus cash challenges from, like, the Tide, the Gain, the Bounty, the Charmin. That's what, like, everyone's getting. So, it's pretty, pretty crazy. But it all ended up still being free and a huge money maker because of these clearance finds. So, I'm going to get on to the first receipt. And the first receipt is literally going to be the Listerine deal, which is pretty pretty easy to follow so i'm gonna go ahead and show that receipt and show you guys the breakdown for that so i picked up the four listerine so here is the receipt as you can see everything totaled up to like i said it would then i had that five of the 25 um covid vaccine coupon and again i always count tax you guys because that's how real I, and that's how real i am um this was the last transaction i did so i didn't have any bonus cash left but i paid $24.64 um, again using my PayPal card because that's the card I use for couponing and I earn back $12 in bonus cash so that already brings the total down to $12.64 and then I'm submitting in it to that Listerine rebate for a total of $10 back and then as you can see here for that $10 Johnson rebate makes it free and a $7.36 money maker 
just for picking up those four Listerines. Because when you spend thirty, you're getting it ten at dollars back on the Activate Rewards. And the Listerine, whatever you spend, it like converts into points. So I spent like thirty two something, and this is before coupons and all that stuff. Of course, before tax as well. So I paid like thirty two something, and then those points, those like if it's like thirty two point four eight. The points will be 3,248, and it's 3,000 points to get a $10 gift card. So that is pretty, pretty awesome for the first transaction for Listerine. Really, really excited how that went out. Next, I'm going to show you guys the um, like this next um thing, which I put on the dial that was on clearance. And I was really, really lucky because it was on clearance. For three twenty four, and I found a two dollar coupon that was hanging and attaching to it, so I made it a dollar twenty four, and it helped me reach so I could use my five off of twenty five. Same with the starter kit, four fourteen had a two dollar coupon, made that two fourteen, and there's my five dollar off of twenty five. Then the cinnamon toast crunch, the checks, and the Cheerios, those are two for six. Spend twelve, get three dollars in bonus cash. Um, and then I just had a one off of two digital load to coupon. And now that I think about it, I forgot. I'm going to submit this into coupons.com, see if I can get the rebate, because I only used one coupon for a dollar off of two. So I should be able to get a dollar back, because I didn't use a coupon on the remaining two cereals. I'm not sure if Jody did that. <laughs> I might have to ask her, but... Um, that's definitely an extra dollar there, so it actually makes this a bigger money maker. Um, and then I picked up the Skittles, two for seven. They're these, like, cute little Valentine ones. I'm not sure if you guys can see it too well. Um, they're, like, Valentine exchange things, and they have, like, you know, to and from. I don't know. <laughs> I just picked them up because they were two for seven, and they would, like, fit my thing perfectly for five off of 25. I'm thinking about when people get bundles, I'll just throw it in there. Um, because that's really, 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 really cute. So now, as you can see here, my total came to $17.15, and then I did earn $3 in a bonus cash for spending $12 on the cereal. That brings the total down to $13.15 with that bonus cash. So then I also got a, well, I'm going to be getting, like in February, I think, $1.80 for spending um, I think it was $7 that I had to spend or $6 for $1.80 back on Skittles. So I should be getting that back. Then I submitted into Fetch Rewards and I got $5.19 back. I'll show you guys that right here. As you can see, $5 and about $0.19 back because I finished a General Mills bonus and then another one is tracking. So that's pretty, pretty awesome. So that was wonderful. And then um, I got $2 back into Ibotta. 50 cents back for each cereal. So as you can see here, a dollar for the Cheerios because I got two 50 cents checks and 50 cents cinnamon toast crunch. So that was pretty, pretty awesome. Then I have to actually do this. I put $5.16, but I got to change it to $4.16 because I'm going to submit this into the coupons.com app for that $1 cashback rebate for the cereals that I did not use a coupon on. So I really shouldn't have trouble getting that in my opinion. Um, so hopefully I'll get that. So it makes that transaction for the two dials, the two Skittles, and the four cereals just $4.16, which is pretty awesome. Now, you guys, let's get on to my favorite find of the day is the Revlon clearance. Now, for the Revlon, I did not use any coupons. We have expired coupons. I don't think Rite Aid takes expired coupons. Um, I know people were saying there's like $3 IPs, like IP means printables, but I wasn't like, you know, I didn't want to get any IPs. I was just like, let me just go and see what I can find. Wasn't expecting to find a lot, but I found a lot. So I think I showed you guys the video and some pictures. But then, as you can see here, all of this was on clearance. So a lot of these, like all of the I bought a rebates were $3 back. So as you can see here, I picked up all of them and this actually totaled me $25. So I used a 5 off of 25 to get additional savings because why not? So as you can see here, this little guy was $2.49. $2 back from my bottom, 51 cent moneymaker. Um, same with all of these eyes. These are going to be a 58 cent moneymaker because we're getting $3 back from my bottom for each of them. Now this one was $3.74. 
this one right here, but I have that $2 coupon. So a $1.74, $3 back from Ibotta, making it like a two-ish dollar moneymaker. Really, really good. And then the rest were $2.52, and I got $3 back. But then that five off of $25 really, really helped really, really well. This is that save $2 now from that. And then for here, I paid out a total of $25. 52 for all of this Revlon clearance. That's after the five off of 25. Pretty, pretty awesome, including tax. Then I submitted into Ibotta and I got $39 back. $39. I got three for the Revlon Face Cosmetics, even though I only picked up two, which was the, the Candid, I don't know how to say that, and that one, so I got an extra $3 for that. So that's why it actually ended up being a little bit more. And then for the Revlon, I maxed out on that deal with the eyes and the lips. Got five of each, five of each, getting 15 back, but like, look at this, this is beautiful, you guys, $39, and we paid a total of $25.52 out of pocket. Are you kidding me? I used three dollars in um bonus cash that I had. Um at two lower in my out of pocket. But yeah, I paid out twenty-five fifty-two, getting thirty-nine dollars back from my bottom, making it a thirteen dollar and forty-eight cent moneymaker for this Revlon makeup. And if I had those <laughs> internet printables, I can't even explain. That would be a huge, huge, huge moneymaker. A huge moneymaker. That would be insane, insane, insane. But I didn't have them. Hopefully you can print them, get them from somewhere. But I was totally fine because, like I said, for me, printing coupons this year, I'm going to be trying to get low, low, low because... Um, ink is expensive, you guys, but it really, really is. And then, um, I'm not sure if I explained this well. I know somebody did comment this before, but about, like, the points earned. So, if you guys can see here, I had, like, reward points. So, I collected a bunch, and that's how much I had in the end. And then I converted them, because I think a 1000 is $2. So, I converted them, and I got an extra $2 in bonus cash. So, everything in the end, you guys, ended up being completely free and an $18.68 moneymaker for all of these items. That is a huge thank you to the Revlon. Like, literally. Even without the Revlon, it would still be a small moneymaker. And, you know, like a small freebie, too. So that's pretty, pretty awesome. Now, let's just hope I get that $1 rebate from coupons.com. If not, it's going to be a $17.68 moneymaker, which is still fine with me. But, yeah, this is what we picked up at Rite Aid today. Pretty, pretty excited about this. And yeah, so thank you, oh, it's dark. Thank you so, so much for watching this Rite Aid video. I will have Jody's channel down below. Huge shout out for her for the cereal and the Listerine deal because I had a bonus cash expiring today and I didn't know what to do. I didn't know what deals to do. And I'm still learning Rite Aid and how to do deals, how to learn all that stuff. What I love so far is the bonus cash literally covers tax and everything. So you're really not paying out of pocket when you use rewards. Versus CVS, um, extra care bucks don't cover tax. So it's pretty, pretty awesome. I'm loving Rite Aid. Um, I definitely want to go once a week. Or not once a week, once a month. Um, when there's good deals because I gotta use my bonus cash and yeah that is it for today's video I will have the Listerine rebate the um, activates reward rebate down below and a Jody's channel down below and really I bought it down below and fetch rewards down below for you guys to sign up and I check all those links out but yeah thank you so so much for watching today's Rite Aid video you guys super excited about hitting Rite Aid again this month I just love it so much I don't know if you guys know but that is it for today's video and yeah I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!